more strangers in the camp. I'll explain on the way. Coming from the Black Lake. Do you feel it? Let's hurry. I promise I can learn how to... Nere, stop. I can't be saved from my own mistakes. This body is only a husk. My spirit must pass on. And you must let me go. Mother, no. I need you. You need to move on, my pie. Without me. But I can help you one last time before I go. You have the divine blessing. Your blood is the necessary key. We have to go. But... Do you think Lilith is even still here? It's been so long, I'm afraid she's won this one. Besides, I have to... Take care of my mother. But it's not over yet. Not for you. Lilith was after Rosma. Find him. Learn why. I'll be back at the vault. All right? This place is full of Lilith's hatred. You are the last visitor to my sanctum. Though, you come too late, just as Lilith did before you. For it was my father, Inarius, who arrived here first. It unfolded as my visions foretold. How we hurtle towards the prophecy's end.
It started in dreams. I saw shattered images of the end of Sanctuary. The scales of a great serpent carried these visions. And so I went to visit him. My and the serpent's thoughts met, and the fragmented future was mended together. I put it down in order, and the prophecy was born. destroy the tumors to go any further. Oh, my God. 
did this. I have done all that was asked. The pain is gone now. This was a just punishment. A stronger man would have refused Venard's bribe. Nerel. Nerel, is she safe? Yes, she is safe. Our meeting is no coincidence. I came here to help. Will you give this to her for me? I should never have taken it. It's so dark. I have repented. Do you think I was too late? No. Not too late. The light has come to carry you home. Do you not see it, friend? Yes. Yes. I see it now. They have come. You didn't need that armor to prove your worth, friend. Give me the key to hell. I will not ask again. You don't mean to. I saw a vision of the key lifted from my corpse, under the watchful eyes of the great serpent in my sanctum. If you are chosen as you say, it will come to pass. Too quiet. Where is she? Is that him? Is that Rathma? I don't know if you would have chosen to stand beside me in this new world, Rathma. But I would have saved your place just the same. And now, all that you might have been has been stolen from me.
happy girl wanted you to have this. Oh. Oh. He was a good man. And Lilith? Was she even there? Did you meet her? Already gone by the time I arrived. There is more. I can see that. Lilith took a key to hell off Rathma's body. <laughs> then it was... all in vain. She's the only one who got what they wanted. Nayra. She came seeking the Haradrim of legend. Seeking hope. She found neither. But her part in things was far from over. In truth, we would need her more than she needed us. Didn't seem that way at the time, though. For anyone. Inarius proved to be just as unreliable as I'd feared. His self-obsession had driven him to murder his son, Rathma. And from the corpse left behind, Lilith had taken a key to hell. Where would she use it? We could only depend on ourselves to find out. Keep it. I am not after your money, just your ear. I can feel it. A great calamity is about to unfold in the northern reaches. The door is in danger. I do not understand. It was sealed for a reason. And now the pig-headed beasts are trying to force it open. Heed my warning and stop them. It must remain sealed. Perhaps a better question is, why are you the only one to take it seriously? I once... <sighs> that was long ago, I suppose. This is it. will not abandon you. Ah, good. You look capable. I could use an extra set of hands exorcising the demon that has seized this man's son. Meet me in the cellar there. And prepare yourself. You're about to witness a miracle. Colder down here than out there. A sure sign of demonic presence. Take my chalice and place it in front of the boy. I need to read through my prayer book for the right passages.
some of the clergy can be eager in their reading of the scriptures. That won't happen here. Oh, praise be. <sighs> Father Inarius, as I shed my wicked blood, let it be purified in thy light. Let the light fill the darkness. Pathetic. This child belongs to me. Angels above! My son! Let the light push out the darkness hiding within this child. Father, force this demon out! <laughs> Your mewling has no power here. Grace, I command you to flee this body! No! No! no. You're welcome. I'm sure I will see you at the next service, yes, Peter? Right in the front pew? Of course, sister, of course! Let us give them a moment. Speak to me outside. well. You are more suited to this work than you think. There are many more people in Kyovoshad who are in need of me. If you have the time, I would welcome your assistance. You have good timing, friend. Quera here is convinced her husband is possessed by a demon. He is! Been disappearing all hours, coming home with bloody hands. He says he does not remember, but he was scaring me. So I tied him up in the cellar until I could get help. And help you shall have. Come, show us where he is. The door is damaged. Quera, stay outside just in case. All right. Demons manifesting already? See her husband. What was that? Vasik, my husband, he was hiding upstairs. He ran... out there, quick, before he hurt someone else. Are you all right? 
It looks worse than it is. I will live. Go! He's close. Careful. This situation is delicate. Like before, take my chalice and place it down as near him as you can. I'll keep his attention. Vasek, just stay calm. Will you save a little on his with me? No! No! Stay away! Everything is going to be all right. Father Inarius, as I shed my wicked blood, let it be purified in thy light. Stop! Please! <laughs> Let the light fill the darkness. No. No. Something's wrong. Vasek! <laughs> Look upon the Relish your meaningless victory while you can. Vasek, uh, oh, I've failed you. I'm so sorry. We need to get out of here. I'm fine. It's nothing a one fire and rest can't cure. Thank you. As badly as things went, they, they would have been much worse without you. <laughs> Somehow, I must find the words to talk Vera about our husband. Take care of yourself, child. A friend needs your help, but we must be cautious. Here, she wanted me to give you this letter. Dear friend, I do not know how much longer my shaking hand will hold a quill, so I shall be brief. I believe the demon we thought we slew in the sewers was able to escape death by using me as its next host. Please. Come to me in Quera's cellar if you can. You're the only one I can trust to help. My life is in your hands. Keep walking before I... Oh, oh it's you. Thank goodness. The sister is in the cellar. Come quickly. And... Thank you for trying to save my poor Vasek. I know you tried your best.
The Cathedral of Light used to perform these kinds of rituals whenever anyone was in need. But it seems that lately they would rather burn the demon along with the victim. I still believe in the Father and his Holy Grace. But I couldn't let that happen to the sister. Not after she saved my boy. No matter what happens to me. Since she collapsed in my arms while telling me what happened to my Vosek. I was going to find a night penitent to help her, but she pleaded with me not to. Asked me to hide her and tell any other priest that came looking that I had not seen her. Truth be told, I had to wrestle with that. Lying to the cathedral? Came close to turning her in more than once. But then I remembered that when I needed help, she did not ask any questions. She was just there, ready to do whatever she could. Well, she deserves the same. Much time you need to perform blood rites, exorcise demon. What? I cannot. You need my prayer book, but Chalice is lost. Need to get new one. Where? Margrave. Matve. He is jealous keeper. Be wary. He is suspicious. You may need to deceive. Please. Hurry. Who are you to demand such a thing? None but those who have dedicated their lives to worship may touch the holy implements. I am on a solemn task from the Reverend Mother Prava herself. Shall I tell her you are unwilling to fulfill her request? Oh, oh, uh, please, forgive me. It is so rare to hear any news from Kyovershad. Let alone from the Reverend Mother herself. I am honored. Here. Here. It will need to be consecrated first, of course. Anointed in the blood of sinners. There are deserving brigands skulking in the caves to the east. Take a piece of the burning wood from this holy pyre and place it in the blood. And do stand back. Excellent. The Reverend Mother was wise to choose you for this task. The chalice is now ready for her. And uh, please, do give her my most respectful regard. Oh, 
thank the light you're back. The sister has taken a turn for the worse. Right after you left, the sister, she... Well, the demon inside her is speaking through her. She's in terrible pain. She told me about the chalice. Here, I'll place it while you prepare. We must hurry. <laughs> oh. Come to watch your friend die. Please, save her. Father Inarius, as I shed my wicked blood, let it be purified in thy light. Let the light fill the darkness within all of us. Your pitiful chanting again? Why are you so eager to she freeze her blood? Let the light push out the darkness hiding within this woman. Father, force this demon out. Light, purge the wickedness. Enough! I tire of this. Sister, no! 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 How is she still fighting? <laughs> Impossible! Please, wake up! Ugh... It's too bloody cold down here. Oh, oh light be praised! Yes, you did well. The demon is truly banished. I'm impressed you were able to copy the ritual so quickly. It took me ages to master. Sister Octavia, you are all right. But these people have engaged in blasphemy of the highest sort. Lying, stealing holy implements, brutalizing a priest of the cathedral. They will burn on the pyre before the day is out. How could you be so rash? When the Reverend Mother... Oh, and what will you tell Prava? That you allowed a commoner to so easily deceive her holy representative? That you abandoned your flock in Margrave and left him with no guidance from the lights? If I am to be tied to that horrific pyre, then you shall be there with me. <coughs> no. <sighs> I... I suppose I have been away from Margrave over long. I should return swiftly. But, Sister Octavia, please, take better care of yourself. The cathedral is stronger with you on your feet than in a sickbed. My friend, give me just a moment and I will meet you outside. You deserve a proper thanks. And thank you, Peter Quera, 
I know it wasn't easy for faithful folk to do what you did for me. Sister, you saved my boy. There was no choice to make. Uh, if we did not do everything we could to save you, how could we call ourselves followers of the light? Yes, I can already feel the warmth returning. Thank you, my friend. I put a great deal of weight upon your shoulders. I asked you to lie for me, to put yourself in grave danger. If you had rejected me, I couldn't say I'd blame you. But you didn't. You saved me. And in so doing, saved countless others I can still help. What about Priest Matvey? Are you worried he will cause trouble? <laughs> no. He will keep what he's seen to himself. Hopefully, I can teach the rest of the clergy to have a bit more faith in the members of their congregation. I want you to have this. It's not much, really, but I hope it brings you some measure of good fortune. Thank you again. You will always have a friend in the cathedral. to hear you passing by me. You there? Yes, you. Come now, don't be shy. I need your help. The damned fanatic Zaya stole my eyes. She wears them around her neck. And what horrid suffering I've witnessed. Please, no more. There's so much blood, I can't. You, you must believe me. I can still see from them. Thea and her flock have grown strong in Ostrava. Please, bring me back my eyes. Thea. <laughs> she was nobody a few years ago. Disappeared for a bit. Came back with friends, blathering on and on about the end of days. She's a liar, but she's also cunning. She snatched up my eyes after all. Thea stole them, pinned them on some necklace she wears, but takes it with her everywhere. Makes me watch. I wonder if my suffering aids her. I, uh, I can see through those eyes, just as you can see me now. But I see his painful. So much pain. So much death. I want my damned eyes back. I 
can see that. Oh, how pitiful I look. Just give me my eyes back, won't you? Can I just push them right back in their sockets? Just like... That... that pain! The sockets burn! Oh, God! Ah!